The weather is fantastic, Larissa. The weather is fantastic, Janelle. We're going to continue to see lots of sunshine and just a tranquil weather pattern unfold. It's been with us all week long. Well, the biggest thing we had this week were the winds on Monday and Tuesday, and now we're dealing with a little bit of fog, especially in South Jersey and in Delaware. We're going to go ahead and take this moment to check in with our weather watchers. Of course, we have eyes all over the region, and Walter in Newark, Delaware, is reporting some fog. Let's see what he is saying. He said, I just might wear shorts today. Happy Friday. Well, Walter, if you do wear shorts, no one's going to blame you. Just make sure to send us a picture so we can show those, show you off. 43 degrees. This is in Parkside. Todd is reporting a temperature of 43 degrees with more clouds than sun. Yes, I know we're starting things off on the cloudier side of things, but we are going to be breaking for sunshine. And then George is reporting a temperature of 47. This is in Denver, PA. He also left me a little note. He says it feels like it's 45 degrees. A mild start to our Friday morning. We're also looking at not nothing around. We do have a little bit of a disturbance that's over the region. I didn't really mention it because it's not generating any precipitation, but you can see that cloud deck that extends from Maine all the way back towards the Virginias. That's that disturbance, and that's why further off towards the east and along the water, we do have some showers. We have no impacts as far as that disturbance is concerned, but that's what's responsible for the cloud cover that we're seeing outside right now. 71 degrees, the daytime high today, the normal for this time of the year, 60, the standing record, 79, and we are talking fog down the shore. Temperatures are mild. We're starting off in the 40s and 50s, but by later today, as I just mentioned, 71 and sunny. And Jim, we're going to stay there through the rest of this weekend. Sounds good. Thank you, Larissa.